Hey, what's up everybody? Let's take a look at batch processing with the all new Brilliance AI instead of On One Photo Raw 2024. It's incredibly easy to use and will instantly get your photos looking better. So let's dive in and take a look. So inside of Photo Raw 2024 here to batch process using Brilliance AI, it's incredibly easy to do. All we have to do is grab the group of images that we want to process. I'll just select this group of photos here and we'll just head over to the right side of our screen. Now, if this right pane isn't open, all we have to do is just go down to this icon at the bottom right corner and we can hide or reveal that there. So let's go up to our Brilliance AI section here. We'll open that up. And to process these images using Brilliance AI, all we have to do is just go into this tone and color option and enable it with on. And within this Brilliance AI section here, and depending on what sort of group of images you're working on, you can modify these different options here to fit that particular group of photographs. So for example, if you're working with a bunch of portraits, you can enable that retouch large faces option that will retouch any prominent portraits or faces within that group of images. I'm sort of working with a mixed group of photographs here, so I'll just leave these as they are, but just keep in mind that you can modify these different options down here for how Brilliance AI works uh, within that uh, group of images that you're working on. And that's how easy it is. Really just go into that tone and color section and enable it. So that was batch processing with Brilliance AI. Thanks so much for watching. I'll see you in the next sneak peek.